Before we get started into the video, I want to tell you guys that I will be away for about five days, so I will not be making a video during that time. I'm going on vacation with my family, so I will come back from that and make some more content. So I hope you guys understand, and I'll see you when I get back. Let's get started into the video. I get those goosebumps every time. I need the hymn. Throw that to the side. I get those goosebumps every time. What is up guys, in today's video we will be doing another flipping for an hour and we will be flipping with 20 mil and we will be buying items that are in like the top 100, basically items that are traded really frequently. And so basically what we're going to be doing, we're going to be checking the margins, buy something high, sell it low, and then see the margin. So I think the buy limit on this is like 13,000, so I'll go ahead and buy that many. And then I checked cannonballs and coal, but the margins aren't as good as I thought they'd be. Normally they're really good. You want to do, you want to do ores, bars, that kind of stuff, because those stuff sell for a lot. So we'll go ahead and check all these first. And I will start the timer now. I forgot to start it, but I'll start it now. So as you can see, the shark is a 10 GP margin. So those are the kind of items you want to buy. I don't remember what the buy limit is. I think it's 6K, but I will look it up. So the buy limit for sharks is actually... I think it's at 10k. So I'm gonna buy. I'm gonna buy this many of them. Yeah, it's 10k. Actually, I need to buy less of those because I already bought 13, so I don't want to buy over the limit because I want to be able to check the margin at the end. If that makes sense. So we'll just do this because I'm not sure how many I bought, but we'll do this. And then another item are raw sharks that are traded a lot. Oh, I actually don't have enough for that. I didn't even realize I spent so much money. Okay, but the steel bars. So I can sell them for 465. So some of the gold bars are coming in. So I need to do some items that don't cost as much. So we can try lobsters. That's pretty good margin, but I'm going to try something cheaper so I can figure it out. Let's try iron ore. Because I only have almost 2 mil to spend. Alright, so that margin's not good either. What about raw lobster? That's okay, we're looking for something better. Let's try law runes. Sometimes the runes are good margins. Okay, so that's a way better margin. Um... I want to say it's 5k, but I will look it up. Oh, it's 12k. I wasn't even close. So notice how this margin's like 5, so that's a lot better. What did I say it was? 9k, I think. I mean 12k. Yeah, 12k. I don't have enough money. Okay, we'll buy... Let's try uh, 9k of them. Nope. Okay, let's try 8k of them. Oh, perfect. Alright, now these are selling, and these are buying. These are not buying, so maybe the price has gone up. I'll check that in a little bit. Okay, so these are all selling. So we're about 5 minutes in, and items aren't buying. I'm not undercutting people. You can't undercut people and make this a lot faster, so I might start doing that towards the end. So these are buying. Just bought a 1,000 of them. But I'm not undercutting them because, so those are all buying. I'm going to try to find an item while I'm looking. What's another, what about death rune? Some death runes. Those are pretty good margins. We'll buy 5k of those. I think we should have enough. Nope. 4k, maybe? Yeah, we'll do 4k of them. So these are still selling. These are buying. Sharks are slowly buying, gold ores are slowly buying. So I noticed swordfish have a good margin, so I'm going to go ahead and buy like 
Um, I bet the buy limit is like 9k of these or something like that. No, that's too many. Okay, we'll do 5k. Can't do that either. We'll do 4k of them. So the steel bar sold. So how much money do we make on that? Steel bar, so 4184. So we made about 30k on that. We could do that again, but I'm going to keep looking. So the law runes are almost sold. The death runes are not buying. The sharks are buying a little slow. The swordfish are not buying. The gold ore is going a little slow. I'm going to go ahead and end these two. The gold ore is still coming in, so I'm going to let that sit. Law runes are almost done. So we have about 4 mil. I'll leave those sharks for a little bit longer. We'll see. Um, I'll come back when I get some more items. So all the law runes fold. So I don't, okay, so 31, 231. So we'll put them in for 231, see if they sell. These gold ore are almost done, and I'm still looking for some other items, so I'll be back when I find some more. So we put in an offer for some blood runes for 215. It's about a 5 GP margin, so we're going to go ahead and see if those sell. I'm probably going to start undercutting people because stuff's not selling. So I'll be back when I find some more items. So ironically, I wasn't undercutting anyone, but someone was undercutting me. That's why none were selling. So I'll go ahead and put an offer for these. I'm going to undercut them. Hopefully I can buy them quicker. These gold ore are almost done. And if I can get those sharks, that's going to be a pretty big margin. And these gold ores are almost done, so I'll be back when those sell. So these sold. I actually don't remember how much gold ore. I don't even know if I have enough room to buy one. Okay, luckily I did. So 323, and I bought them for 320, so we can sell them for 323. Not great margin, but... Better than nothing. And these sharks are buying a lot faster now that I undercut the person. I hate undercutting, but sometimes you have to. Um, these blood runes are not buying, so I'm going to have to undercut someone. These law runes are barely selling, so we might check that in a little bit. So we put in some offer for some monkfish. I undercut the person by 1 GP. So I don't have enough money to do anything right now, so I'm going to go ahead and wait a little bit. We're at 15 minutes, so we still got a while, so I'll come back when some of this stuff is selling and buying. Alright, so these law runes sold pretty quick, and these shark bought. So I'm going to put the sharks in for 1k, so a 10 GP margin. So that would be a big one. Um, I want to check the raw sharks again, and maybe the raw monkfish and some other items, and then I will be back. So I don't know if it's just a fluke. One person might have done it, but I don't know. Let's hope it's not. There's a huge margin on raw monkfish, so I undercut them by 1. If it stays like this, I might even undercut by a few more GP, but let's hope they buy. Um, these monkfish are buying slowly. The sharks will probably start selling soon, and these gold ore are selling kind of slowly, so I might change those prices, but I'll be back when I do something. So I changed some of the prices, and everything's moving a little bit more smoothly. We're at 22 minutes. I'm putting in an offer for Mythical Bars, so we'll see if those sell, because they have a pretty good margin right now. It's about like a 6 GP margin, so we'll see how that goes. Um, I might move stuff around again, so we'll see. So just an update, I'm still buying the Mythical Bars. I'm now buying Raw Sharks. I got rid of the raw monkfish and switched them and just started selling them because none of them were buying. I'm now selling the monkfish because none of them are buying. The sharks have kind of stopped selling and the gold has stopped selling, so that's kind of sad. So I think I might put those in for 321. I bought them for 320, so that sucks. So let's hope I don't have to put them any lower. And I think I bought these for 390, so I will go 995. I think that's about as low as I'll go because they should sell. They should. <laughs> they should sell. Anyways, so everything's starting to sell now. So let's hope that works. And we'll see what happens. So I have done a lot of new stuff. I bought some new longbows. Um, I flipped the mithril bars. They've almost sold. I'm still buying raw sharks, buying coal, buying knee logs, and selling those. So I bought these for 682. And I can sell them for 690. So we'll try selling them for 689 and we'll see if they sell. And then I'm almost done with these items. So then I'll be investing that in more stuff. So I'm at 35 minutes and these have sold. These items are slowly buying. I think I'm going to invest in death runes and undercut them and buy about 6k of them. I can actually buy more than them, so I'll buy about that many. And I will see what happens. So I just flipped these raw sharks and sold them instantly. I probably should have sold them for more. These death runes are buying a little too fast. I don't know what's going on there. I moved the shark price down. I moved the U longbow down. 1 GP a little bit ago. And these coal and e logs are almost bought. And this gold ore is not selling anymore, so I might have to end up selling that at the very end because I bought it for 320, so I don't want to lose money on it yet. Ooh, these death runes just sold. Let's see how much money we can sell them for for 368. 
So let's try 367. And that'll be a pretty good margin if we can get those. Oh, whoops. Not 367, 267. I was going to say that's a lot of money. But anyways, I will sell these and then I will be back. Oh, wow. Those actually sold instantly. So never mind. I won't leave. Those are almost sold. These are almost bought. So I'll probably sell those in a sec. So I'll be back. So these e-logs bought. U-logs. I keep saying e logs I just realized that. U-logs. I did that in another video on accident. Um, this coal bot, I'm just going to go ahead and sell it now. So I bought it for 184 Do I have the old prices? No. So I'll check these margins and then I will sell them. So I sold a lot of the coal instantly. And I don't want to sell it instantly. So I decided to move the price up. I did end up selling all these. So that's good money right there. I put in the e-logs for about 3GP profit. These aren't selling still and these aren't selling. So I'm worried I'll have to instant sell those at the end. I hope not. So now we'll find some more items and try to bust out this last 20 minutes. So this is kind of where I'm at. I'm going to, oh, I just sold all these finally. Thank God. I'm trying to buy these. I don't know if they're going to buy. I sold all these finally. These are still not selling. I decided to put an offer on iron knives just in case. And I put in some on some grapes because I know they sell a lot. So we'll see. Okay, so they're already buying. So I can sell those for a good margin, about 10 GP. So we'll see if those go. These coal are still selling. So I still have about 15 minutes. I don't want to mess this up because I don't want to end up instant selling these. So I'll try to invest in probably one more item and then call it good. So I'm at about 13 minutes. So I'm putting in some off for some dragon bones. Still putting in the offers for the grapes. Still trying to sell the coal. So I will, and the sharks, I move them down. Um, I will probably give it about five minutes and then I will try to sell everything. And we'll see if we can make profit in time. I'm now trying to sell everything with about 11 minutes left. So let's hope all these sell. I'll come back. And hopefully they have been sold. I am really surprised all those already sold. So I'm going to go ahead and try to get some more dragon bones real quick. Before the time runs out. We have about 10 minutes. So let's see what happens. So I bought some of the dragon bones. So I'm going to go ahead and just sell those now. While the sharks are selling. And then hopefully we will make some good profit. Let's go ahead and sell these. And I'll be back. So we made it. There's still about 3 minutes left. But there's no point in buying other items. Because I won't have enough time. So let's hope we made a lot of money. Let's actually go here. Okay, so we made 287k in one hour. That's not amazing, but a lot of the items that I normally buy, like coal and other bars and other ores, weren't selling right away. But if you can sell those, you can make a lot more money. But I hope you guys like this flipping video. If you want to see more of these kind of videos, leave a comment in the comment section. And as always, guys, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for my next video.